Hello and welcome to this tutorial on Air Magnet Survey Pro, covering multi-view and diff view. The multi-view function is extremely useful for comparing data across multiple floors of a multi-story building. To begin using multi-view, I will first open one of my floors in Survey Pro. Once I have my project open, I will select multi-view on the top menu to view the other floors in my building. At the same time, I will open the survey data from these other floors as sub-projects of my first floor. To do so, I will click the Import Sub-Project button. I will find the particular project files that I need, select them, and then click Import. Now all of my floors are visible on the screen at the same time. To load the map information for a floor, I can select a given survey from the menu on the top left. Much more interestingly, I can now create a correlated view across floors by selecting access points in the tree to the bottom left. In this case, we can see that the access point that I have selected can be heard on my third floor, second floor, and even somewhat on my first floor. Navigating results in multi-view allows you to see the bleed through that can occur in a site survey between floors. This allows me to tie together data taken on surveys between different floors to understand bleed through between those floors and to see where an AP's coverage is extending beyond the floor where it's located. Visualizing multiple floors at the same time can be very helpful for determining where bleed through is occurring and where interference on one floor is being caused by an access point on another floor. Now moving to diff view. In diff view I'm looking at this same floor plan but looking at two different pieces of data and cross comparing them. In my example today, I would like to compare my active survey against my virtual survey or my plan. A comparison such as this would allow me to see the differences between the data I collected live in the site versus the plan that I had originally put forward. The difference is shown in the heat map at the top, with a red color indicating a negative dB difference between the first survey and the second survey, and a green color showing a positive dB difference between the first survey and the second survey. Ideally, I would see little to no difference, with the colors being mostly very muted or washed out. In our example today, I can see mostly it's the same, but I do have some patches of dark green, as well as some patches of moderate dark red, indicating that my coverage as I had expected it and planned it was not a direct match for the survey when I performed it. Diff view can be very helpful in an example like this for comparing a plan versus the reality, or comparing two surveys taken at two separate times. Thanks very much for watching, and thank you for choosing Air Magnet Survey Pro.